What is up guys, John here from The Invasion Show, and uh, in typical Yubi fashion, Operation Void Edge gameplay has leaked. Now, before we move forward, I just gotta throw it out there, if you're not a fan of leaks, please turn away, because we're about to see Operation Void Edge and the two new operators in legit action. I'll make sure to leave links down below so you can catch it yourself. But without further ado, we're going to watch this trailer. I can't wait to see what's new to the table. Uh, we're probably going to see that Oregon rework. And uh, I know there's also rumblings that Castle, you know, Ca our boy Castle is uh, just, uh, he got the rework. We'll dive into that in a different video, but we're going to check out this Operation Void Edge trailer. Clocking in at almost seven minutes long. So we're going to make this go as quickly as possible. So without further ado, let's go. A new force of destruction that was Oryx. coming to Rainbow Six Siege in Operation Ooh, Void Edge. Oh man, Oryx. His name is Oryx. He's a defender, and in addition to crashing through soft Dude. walls and sturdy Frenchmen, he can also perform other feats of athletic prowess. That is a. What is he rocking there? The ARX? And the and MP5? Attacker, Yana. Don't be alarmed. Yana. If you shoot her and she disappears. That's just her hologram that looks, moves, and sounds exactly like her okay maybe that's a little alarming it, it probably can't shoot Here's people the rundown on the new operators <gasps> and their gadgets oh my and word what they can do on the newly renovated Oregon. she's killing people this is oregon let's start with the new jordanian defender oryx jordanian the smashing is he from this okay. is powered by his rima dash ability rima. a quick sprint that lets him move faster than any other operator dude he can knock attackers to the ground including montane, montane and other shield bearers that is so strong he can also smash through barricades and unreinforced walls he lives a, that while barricades a huge hole breeze, he does take some damage when crashing through a wall so <gasps> don't get too smash happy without a friendly dock nearby i like that i like that balance 1v1 to wood paneling Ooh. look he just downed Orcs himself runs on charges <laughs> He can use them rapidly to dash a few times in a row, but they take time to replenish. And oh, they reset to zero when you bust through a wall. It's on a meter. Nice. Gridlock's track stingers and Nomad's air jack. Obviously, it's going to slow him down. Dash, and it takes a moment for him to get his gun back up after dashing. Plus, Oryx's footsteps aren't exactly subtle when he dashes. His ability is more about speed and strength. Dude, Oryx. That's ooh, and that's he's got one more trick up his complete lack of sleeves. Oryx can jump up and grab open hatches. What? Peek at his surroundings and drop down. Oh! Or pull himself up through the hatch oh! or above. He can't do it on roof hatches, and you'll have to break open the hatch first. So choosing his Dude! primary over his MP5 or his bailiff sidearm over his USP40 isn't a bad idea. But his climbing ability is independent he climbs. of his dash charges, so you can use these two skills in tandem. This Dude, it's like Oryx, a dangerous new defender who will have attackers right. looking over their shoulders. That just single-handedly changes everything. Operation Void Edge is also bringing the attackers their own deceptive new threat. Dude, even though it's something that Yana. can't hurt the defenders at all. This is the new Dutch operator, Yana, and Yana. this is her hologram. Using her Gemini replicator gadget, Gemini Yana replicator. creates and controls a hologram she was that born in June? looks like her, including her headgear, uniform, and primary weapon skin. She doesn't need line of sight. Like her, with the exception of rappelling or climbing ladders, and sounds like her. Dude, she While can be controlled. While it deal damage to enemies or physical objects, it can have serious effects on the defender's survivability. This is nuts. Siege, you're... you're... In addition to scouting traps, but not triggering <laughs> them, Yana can make defenders think she is breathing down their necks and bait them into throwing their C4 or dupe Smoke or Goyo into oh. triggering their gadgets prematurely. Dude. After all, when a defender sees the hologram... I want to see more of that ARX. ...or hears it in a hallway, how are they to know it's not the very real and very dangerous Yana? Convincing as it is, the hologram is fragile. One bullet will destroy it. Dude! As will electricity or... She's got the G3. Cameras. Maestro's evil eyes can zap it as well. And they can detect the hologram by the telltale lack of warm body glow. Shooting Yana's hologram does not result in a location ping, 
as with alibis prisma holograms. Okay. And it can't ping locations, <gasps> Look at him. scan Look at enemies, him. or see vigil when he's using he, his cloaking He's gone. Device. Plus, Yana can't <gasps> move while her hologram is active. So defenders are temporarily safe from her ARX 200 or G36. How many charges? Weapon, is it unlimited? MK1 9mm sidearm. Ooh. But she doesn't just have one hologram. The cooldown period is longer if it's destroyed than if she deactivates it. But oh, it's on a meter? Always it's on meter! Whether she's using it to run solo misdirection plays or conspiring with teammates oh, in a coordinated man. push, Yana's deceptions can have deadly consequences. Ooh, I felt, I felt, <laughs> I felt like he was going to TK. Site on the Oregon map, Dude, Oregon looks been removed really nice. Part of some key renovations to rework the map. Oh, wow. The nearby small office tower has been expanded on both levels, giving defenders more room to work with when keeping a That's huge. Bay. The basement area like. has also grown, with the dorm stairs now extending down one level and connecting through a new freezer section to the old basement. Ooh. Operators looking to traverse the attic connector above the meeting hall will have more options, including a redesigned floor plan near the master bedroom and a new exterior Let's second see floor window, oh. but the ladder to the first floor has been removed. Word? You'll also find a new hallway connecting the big tower directly to the kitchen allowing you to bypass the meeting room entirely. <gasps> Operation oh. Void Edge is also bringing some impactful like. gameplay updates that you'll want to know about. I like. Changes to barricade damage will make breaking boards Thank goodness. More consistent and Thank goodness. destructive. Oh. Attacker drones will now spawn on the same side of the building as the attacker's first spawn location. Thank choice. you. And the player hub will be revamped for improved navigation. Oh, that's clean. These updates, as well as the Oregon map rework, will be free for all players when Operation Void Edge Ooh. launches. Dude. The new operators, Oryx and Yana, will be available at launch for year five pass owners, and everyone else can unlock them a week later using Renown or R6. Crew. Oh man, I need, I need to get on the TTS. I need to get on the TTS. channel and visit us at news.ubisoft.com. Oh my goodness, this Oryx and Yana duo, it is just crazy. Oh my goodness, ladies and gents. Uh, February 17th is when we get to jump on the test servers, which is just what two days two days away two days away We get to play this on the test servers. This is absolutely Mind-boggling the abilities alone is something to note. I always wanted alibi or alibi to have the ability to control her holograms. I was always talking about, you know, switching stances alone, you know, from crouch to prone. But Yana, she does the whole thing. The whole thing. And I and I feel like I called in the video when she was controlling it while her eyes were glowing. She full on has manipulation of this this drone. I mean, this is just insane. And for those who are worried if Siege is definitely going into this more futuristic, you know, realm, well, guess what? It is, especially with Yana. And let's not forget Oryx. I mean, the dude is just straight on linebacker mode. I mean, I gotta play the video again because this is absolutely amazing. Oryx is so cool. Look at this. And then uh, I just can't get enough. Ladies and gentlemen, let me know your thoughts, especially, you know, these two new operators. And I barely even spoke about Oregon, but Oregon, so, f oh, I'm sorry. He jumps up to hatches. Let's not forget that Oryx is, what, the first operator that jumps hatches, that jumps to hatches. He jumps. Let's just call it what it is. He's the first operator to jump. Um, and if you want to count Amaru with her, no, that doesn't count. That doesn't count. I know he's not the only one that goes up hatches, but first of all, he looks cool. He looks like me when I get older. Uh, I just got to give her to this. The Lamash Dash? Damn. This is, now this is fun. Like I said, Oregon looks much bigger and it looks much better. I'm digging that. It doesn't look crazy. Uh, Her Hereford Base is like one of the, mm, personally, dislike that map rework 100%.
Now this is a map rework that I can get behind. And also, let's not forget, Theme Park's rework is actually quite nice. I like it. This might be the best rework map out there to date. I'm just throwing it out there, let me know down below. Uh, the fact that their abilities are running on meter is, is fantastic. You don't have to really uh, worry so much, though you still have to manage your abilities. You, you gotta just manage them, but man, it's freaking cool. It's it's virtually unlimited. I like it. Oh man, oh man. And their weapons. I really didn't speak too much. And that you know, you got the MP5, you got the the bailiff, the Spaz 12 over here. And I think uh, was it the Vector or maybe that was just Goyo. Anyway, I I'm just solely hooked on these abilities. Let me know your thoughts down below, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, and I know there's more stuff that's going to be revealed throughout this weekend. I'll make sure to update each and every one of you on that. But uh, let me know your thoughts on this trailer. Let me know your thoughts on this operation in general. This is some craziness. Oh, Oryx. Anyway, guys, I'm John from The Invasion Show. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to help support the channel absolutely for free, all you got to do is hit that subscribe and bell icon to get notified whenever I upload videos. Man, he does knock people down. That's that's sweet. That's the that's that's the deal. Oh. Anyway, this is John saying peace, peace, chicken grease. Yo, this is still cool. This looks dope.